American 2600, contact Indy Center, 134. Hi, Dick Rochford here, aboard the Piper M600 single-engine turboprop aircraft. 600 shaft horsepower. We're in cruise flight, flight level 280. And uh, we're... Uh, uh, looking at fuel, uh, 1,400 pounds on board, and uh, we see that here in the fuel gauges total, and then the computer is keeping up with that pretty well, 1,406. Now then, once we know the computer has the right number, we can uh, then look at the, the rings. And uh, what we're able to see is we could go quite a ways past our destination. And that's confirmed by the f fuel on board over the destination, the FOD. And uh, we've uh, put in a vertical navigation, so we have a top of descent. And uh, that's all worked out in advance. Eventually, as we get a little closer, the vertical speed required will populate here. And then in planning the descent, we can begin that descent either with VS or VNAV. And so let's say that we get a, a crossing restriction. Cross Ipswich at maintain some altitude. We'd set the altitude in here, whatever it is. And then we'd arm the VNAV, VS, if we wanted to start down immediately, VNAV, and then VNAV direct, if we wanted to begin that descent. So we can see here, our five miles before the destination, want to be at pattern altitude, essentially. That'll just keep us apprised of uh, of what we ought to, you know, what we ought to be doing. So if we if we want a thousand foot per minute descent, we can set that in here. We can set in MSL or AGL, and then uh, populate a top of descent on the chart, which does automatically when you. Compute the VNAV. That's right there. And then the, the orange is the five mile bottom of descent. Once we start down, we get the blue banana indicating when we'll be at that uh, altitude. But the best way to compute that. The most accurate, I should say, would be to use the VNAV feature, and maybe VNAV direct if the controller uh, obviates the uh, uh, pilot's discretion. United 2306, contact Indy Center. So many of you may already know that uh, crossing restriction implies pilot's discretion, and uh, and so this vertical navigation capability on this aircraft takes full advantage of that. Uh, uh, at pre so one tango, Papa, traffic 12 o'clock and this uh, is Dick Rochford. We have a nice smooth day here. Two eight zero. Fly safely. Train off. Twenty four zero six traffic twelve o'clock and uh, twelve miles off the direction of Challenger, leveling at three three.